I watched the final Steve McQueen uh, small axe film that, that was shown at New York Film Fest, which is Red, White, and Blue. Um, this one is, stars John Boyega uh, as you see his, his character kind of think about joining the police force, go through that kind of internal struggle of like, well, how do I do that as a black man? Is that is that right? Is that not? He decides ultimately that he does want to join because he wants to to kind of build build a gap between those communities, um, and mm-hmm. uh, doesn't doesn't sound it doesn't go too well. <laughs> um, so it kind of it takes a bit to fully form. Um, it, it's it's really much a slow build about a young officer trying to to help right the divides between his community. But it also emphasizes how deep the problem is um, as John Boyega's character is faced with an intense amount of prejudice and hate from nearly all sides. Um, the systemic issues are shown in, in its full color. Um, and, you know, this is he's your good apple. So <laughs> that's how they're treated. So this is definitely your least favorite of the three correct but it's still good it is still good uh, this okay. one's a much slower build though um like this really? this one would not hold up to other mcqueen films i think because it's packed in in an anthology series it gets away with a bit more than i think we would normally give hmm interesting but it's still good how is uh how's boyega in this very good very very good okay that's cool. And that wraps up that review. If you want to hear more reviews and other snippets from our full monthly show, go ahead and click the box over here. Or you can also check out our weekly mini episodes in the other box. Yeah, and make sure to hit the circle in the middle to subscribe.